hello guys so today let's learn max and minimum functions in python so max means you know the python max function is used to find the greatest or largest value in a list of values and python minimum function is used to find the lowest value in a list so both are built in functions and only take one value a variable that holds a list or string fine so max and minimums are python's built in functions clear so let's see how to use max and minimum functions but before that obviously i need one list okay so let's create one list here student student strength okay so i am creating strength okay just suppose i am writing here 25 30 35 40 or you can say any other number you can write here 32 okay so just suppose this is my list okay i am writing here the strength of a class fine so now if i want to have the minimum number from this list okay so for that purpose what i'll do i will simply print minimum and what is my list name what is my list name okay so list name is stu strength 6a okay so this is my list fine so let's run and check the output minimum number so it will show the minimum number here so the minimum number is 20 in this particular list okay so 20 is the minimum number in this list okay now what if i if i have to find out the maximum number okay so what i will do i will simply simply write here max clear so let's see and check the output so you can see 20 is the minimum number and the maximum number is 40 here i hope the basic thing is clear to you how to use the maximum and minimum and how to find out the number just suppose if we want to find out the cheapest supplier in our list okay so let's see for that also that thing also uh, let me comment it out first okay just suppose i have supplier okay supplier quote quotation clear so let's create one list here suppose i am writing here 2.28 3.28 then 3 2.27 okay 3. 20 okay and after that i have 3.26 3.26 okay suppose this is my quotation list fine now i want the cheapest price so what i will do simply i will write here print okay
the cheapest price is dollar okay so i am using the dollar symbol here for uh, having the quotation okay so after that i want the minimum one so minimum i will write here this list name okay then after that uh, just suppose i am writing here okay per gallon of milk okay so i simply want this okay output so if i will save this and i will run it then let's check the output so it is giving me the output the cheapest price is dollar 2.2 Two seven per gallon of milk. So this was the minimum price here in the list. Okay, if you want to see the list here, two point two seven is the minimum price because I have written the uh, quotation. Uh, I have written to find out the minimum quote. Okay, so this is like that. Okay, so my code will return the minimum value, smallest value. okay just suppose if i want to find out the maximum so what i will do i will simply write here instead of minimum i will write here max okay now what if we have to use python minimum and maximum with strings okay so in numbers so we were finding out the smallest and largest value in a list okay so what how they will perform when we will use it with strings so minimum will find out minimum and maximum methods they will be used to find out the smallest and largest character in the string okay so in this case smallest and largest refers to the position of the character in the alphabet okay the smallest possible character is the capital letter a and all capital letters comes first in python and largest character is is the lower case letter z okay i hope it is clear to you so let's see here okay how to do that fine just suppose if i have to find out the grade okay i have a string that is con that contains the grades for every student okay in 6th grade maths class so we want to know what the lowest grade was okay so let's calculate it and see how to use fine so let me create one more list here now okay fine so let me write down grades okay a a b a c c d a i'm just writing it randomly so you don't need to worry about it okay d d c c and then bb fine so this is my list okay uh, so grades fine now i want to print it so i will simply write down here print the lowest grade in the class was okay then after that comma fine so i want to find out maximum or minimum if you find out the maximum so let's write down here maximum okay grades 
because this is my list name okay and close fine so mac why i have written here maximum because of course if i will if it will find out d so uh, d is the lowest grade okay so that's why i have to write down here maximum fine so let's run and check the output here so it is telling you the maximum grade the uh, sorry the lowest grade was e so it is telling the lowest grade was e here okay because e is the maximum one here clear so this is how we can calculate the grade system if you want to find out the minimum matlab greatest one then you will write down here minimum okay so th uh, this uh, this is how the program works exactly fine so let's see here just suppose okay you have the three student names with you fine and you want to find out which one comes last alphabetically so let's see how to do that also okay first of all let me comment it out here so i have to create here okay so student 1 is equal to i will write here name just suppose i am writing here kanav okay and fine so after that i am writing here student 2 okay fine so if i have to write down next name so i will write here tanav okay and next name if i have to write down i will simply write here 3 is equal to tanme okay so these are the three names with me now i want to print i want to check that which one comes last alphabetically okay so simple print okay and i will write here the name that appears last in the alphabet okay is alphabet is fine double quotes fine and after that comma okay maximum so i will write here max okay so i have to find out out of these so what i will do i will simply copy control c and i will go there and i will paste are yaar I will paste here. Fine, student one. Okay. I don't want to uh, write here the names. Okay. So I simply have to write down the things. Okay. Okay, so this I am just simply clearing it. Fine. Fine. So let's see here. Control S. So the output. The name that appears last in the alphabet is Tanme. why it is coming because why is the alphabet that comes at last if we see in our alphabets from a to z okay then u v w x y so y comes at the last okay 
so that's how we can use the maximum and minimum in different different ways okay i hope we have seen that when while working with the list or strings we know that how to find out the lowest or highest value that appears in that list or string fine so this tutorial discussed how to use minimum maximum methods with python list and strings okay i hope the concept is clear to you okay thank you